I've just landed my first gig in the big city. What's up and welcome to this episode of Road to Professional DJ. I have just had my first gig confirmed to play in London. That is an absolute dream come true as someone who's born in the UK to get a gig in the capital city has always been a goal of mine and also I'm lucky enough living in the UK that our capital city is London. London is, it is without a doubt one of the capital of clubbing in the entire world especially for the genre of music I love which is house music I'm so happy to have got the gig but before I dive too far into what the gig itself is I thought I would actually let you guys know exactly how it is I landed that gig because it's that which I feel offers you guys the most amount of value so the way I got this gig is I have been recruiting people on uh, to come and play on some of the projects I've been working on spring break Amsterdam is one of the projects I have been recruiting DJs for recently I got one gentleman involved who has done really well for our project he's helped out so much um, and he will definitely be flying over and playing that gig with my brand boxed in for spring break Amsterdam this gentleman is a Hungarian chap who will be putting on a gig on February the 2nd. Let me quickly just get the name. The guy who's headlining is a massive Hungarian DJ. It's not one I actually knew before, but his name is Sturbinski. I may or may not have got that right, but I will put a picture of the event up now so that you can see. It's at Club Aquarium in um, London on Saturday the 1st of February. So that will be an awesome gig. If any of you do want to come to that gig, then you can check it out in um, the link below. Will be The link below will be in the bio. I'm really looking forward to that gig. As I said, it's going to be my first one in London. It's been quite a good um, a little proof of the theory that if you help other people other people will help you um, so if you can keep making sure you're offering other people gigs if you get the opportunity you're helping other people run their events and all doing good things like that it means that the swings and roundabout nature means that it will, there will become a time when I'm sure those people will be able to help you out and give you gigs too. So anyway, that is my first London gig confirmed, which I'm absolutely buzzing about. We did try and do a gig there before a boat party, but the whole thing kind of flopped. Um, I don't mind saying that on this channel because that's what it's all about. Um, not everything you do do will uh, work perfectly. There will be some amazing perks and there has been been also amazing highs which there has been in my DJ career so far but there will also be some stinking lows um, and trying to organize that boat party which some of you early subscribers may know about um, last summer I did try and organize a boat party in London but basically it never got to the ground um, sadly we lost a wedge of money on it and the event never even set sail no pun intended um, but it does now mean it's my second shot at trying to get a gig in London I have landed it um, and I'm so buzzing to be playing Club Aquarium on the 1st of February. So come on down if you're in the area. Um, but if not, I hope that's given you a nice little insight as to how I'm getting some of these gigs. So first London one ticked off. Great news, hallelujah. Thank you so much for watching A Road to Professional DJ. Make sure you do hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more stuff coming soon. Cheers.